I get so used to like having you around that every time I wake up and if you're not there like last night it, it just leaves me like sad. I can't believe we are finally here. This is the place we, where our love story started. I remember the first time I laid eyes on you. I was 22 years old, working at, at the spa reception, and I saw this incredibly gorgeous guy getting interviewed on the patio right outside the spa. I was thrilled to see that you got the job, but was completely crushed finding out how old you were, or should I say how young you were? <laughs> we meet here today to witness the sacred ceremony. The union of Jordan and Joanna with great reverence, we come together to celebrate the love and the devotion shared by these two children of the universe. I love the memory of the first time we hung out outside of work. I saw you by the catamaran walking your, your bike headed home. I drove up to you and asked if you'd like to put your bike in my trunk. <laughs> From there, our friendship was filled with trips to the dog park, island nights, reggae concerts, Elko Mexican food, sneaking you in a party bus to Boyer, and jam sessions with Tribal Theory at my PB house. All of that leading up to the moment on, our, on your 20th, 20th birthday when you asked to kiss me for the very first time. I didn't know it at the time, but kissing you that day was the best decision I ever made. From the first day I met you, you were so out of my league here at the spa. And obviously I was 18 years old and you were just like, you are about to graduate college. You're just this beautiful girl that had everything in the world for you, starting out in the world. I was so nervous to talk to you and your inappropriate self just, <laughs> just had me at a loss for words. All this time has shown me that I love you and not just being in love with you, but in many different ways. I love you because you were a great coworker. I love you because you were a great friend. You're my best friend. And you are still my best friend. And I love you because you're so great with your family. And now I'm in love with you as about to be my wife. <laughs> Every morning when I wake up to your smile, there's no words to describe the feeling. So I have to use our favorite word, and that's soulmates. <laughs> our relationship faced many challenges and we both had our demons to overcome. But I wouldn't change any of it because all of our moments, good and bad, has brought us to this perfect moment. As we stand here, even amidst this crazy pandemic world, <laughs> I'm overwhelmed with so much joy and at peace at the same time knowing I get to be by your side for life. Uh, you make me so happy and laugh every single day. Your kindness for others and the love language you show me overfills my heart. You always inspire me to be the best version of myself. You are my lever man that balances out my feisty, stubborn, crazy Leo side. You have been the only man capable of taming this lion. You and Joanna inspire me. Your unwavering commitment and dedication to each other through all the ups and downs in life. You stuck by each other's side when times got rough and you proved to each other over time after time how unconditional your love truly is. Your love is rare, cherish it. I have the honor to see you grow into the most incredible man who I always knew you were and continue to grow every single day. I have loved you for more than a decade and my love still continues to grow. I know your mother is here with us right now in spirit, bawling her eyes out with joy and so incredibly proud of her son she has created. I remember back in the day before meeting you, I would often daydream and fantasize, especially as I sit in front of the, the spa, watching all the weddings and envisioning one for my own. I often wonder why I rarely fantasize these days and realize it's because I'm already living out my fantasies with you. You are my dream come true. You're better than any wish I could be granted. You're better than a dream come true. 
And not just because you were out of my league and I still got you. And not just because you're so goddamn beautiful. Sorry, guys. But it's because every day you make me happier and a better person than I was the day before. I'm beyond ecstatic to marry you. I vow I'll always be here for you. I vow I will protect you and everything that we love. I vow I'll support you even when I'm feeling down. And I vow I'll love you so hard for the rest of my life. <laughs> you are my best friend, soulmate, the best partner in life and the best fur and feather baby daddy there is. I can't wait to see what an incredible father you'll be to our little human. On this day, I give you my heart. I vow to always honor, respect, and cherish you. I vow to encourage your kindness, optimism, dreams, and goals. I vow to be a true and loyal friend and treat you as my equal through all of our years, all that life may bring us. And lastly, I love you with all my heart, always and forever. I've been clear-minded the whole time. The only time I was a little shook up was when she made her vows. That, that kind of hit me in the feels. Like that was, that threw me off. Like I wasn't prepared for that at all. So then I got here and I'm back to, back to the groove thing, you know? <laughs>